everyone. My name is Guillermo Olivo. We're, we're broadcasting live. Why is it live thing not showing up? I don't know. Let's see. Uh, -ch 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 -ch. I think we did it. Let's see. There we go. We're broadcasting live from us from our store located in Sunrise. As you all know, we open a store. But here's the thing, and this is one of the wonders of having a store. We got a massive, massive Minton car collection of Star Wars figures that I, I was like, well, you know, maybe I can make a post about it. Maybe I can go live on Instagram. Maybe I can, you know, post pictures and, and some of that. But what better way than to go live from the store and show you all what we got. So I'm just going to share. We're not going to go and talk about pricing or anything like that. I mean, you're more, more than welcome to either reach out, send a message or pass by. We want to see you. We want to see you here. I've been waiting all day for the store to close down. We had a really good day. It was packed today. A very surprising Tuesday packed. And so we're waiting all day to do this. Let's go. Let's go straight up to what we're doing. So hit the two shot and let's just start. Well, we're going to start with this guy. Go back to me. And go back to me. There you go. So the first one that I'm showing, this guy is FAA graded. He graded 60. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna dwell too much into why the grade was like that or anything like that. But I, we got we start the whole you can go to a two shot sir. I have a director helping me. Uh, we're gonna start with this beautiful, beautiful sample of let me fix this shot a little bit. I can help it man. Of this 12 pack Jawa graded FAA 60. Man, nothing beats a 12-pack. Obviously, this is how everything is started. And, you know, there's nothing, nothing as cool as a 12-pack. So let's leave this guy here for a minute. We'll, I'll try to, I'm going to, I'm just, I'm not going to talk too much about each one of them because there's a lot of them. Trust me, let me fix the shot. There's a lot of them. And I'm just going to sort through them a little bit so you guys can see it. I have... A beautiful R2, another 12 back. Um, let's put it right here. You can bring it up. Thank you, John. Beautiful R2. Uh, this one is not graded, but it, I think it's in great condition. I love when it has stickers like Target and that type of stuff. Oh, I can see there's a little detail there. I haven't been able to even surf through them uh, much, so I was just eager to show everyone. These are going to be priced and available tomorrow for sale to anyone um you have you have text you have oh you have comments let's see hello indiana go get her scotty hello how are you you want you want to put it up there well, maybe keep it down so that you don't block my face keep it down above the there you go how are you doing thank you for connecting so let's let's show the next one the next one you can remove that the next one is another 12 back but this time What's up, Chaps? Chaps is in the house. Carlos Barron, you don't you don't want to know, bro. The beautiful thing about having a store is that you ne I'm I'm tempted to do like a pawn shop type of thing. I just have cameras here because you have no idea what happens every day. You have no idea who's gonna come out through that door with a big box of 12 packs. This one is not graded either, but Princess Leia is always going to be a great contender. I see the bubble there has some details, but you know, there's a little bit of everything in, in this lovely realm of things. So let's keep digging through the first box. The next one is another 12 pack, but this is the base of the acrylic case. Let's fix that real quick. So people don't get this live, live broadcasting. This is a Han Solo, a small head. Yeah, he's a small head, which happens to be my favorite. That's the best of having a store. Yeah, you got that right, Carlos. Collections comes to you, and we're open to that. It's another beautiful 12-pack. It has all these details on the car, but these cars are already, you know, they have, they're older than me. Let's say it like that. All right, who's, who else is here? Another 12 pack, but this time it's a farm boy. Who doesn't want a farm boy in their life? 
Thank you, Wayne. We're looking forward to see you here tomorrow, man. Another 12 pack, and this one is rated by AFA 50. I guess the bubble has seen better days, and you know, the bubble is the main thing that dictates um, the grading. I think you're going to have to go further down the road with those with those cards, because there you go. Let me show the back of it a little bit. Señores, Gin Tonic en el cine desde Madrid. Big hug to you guys. Les mando un abrazote desde allá en Madrid. Eh, acá mostrando unas joyitas que conseguimos. Uh, Wayne, I don't have the prices with me right now. There's there's a lot of them. You'll see if you keep watching the transmission. We have a bunch of them. Uh, but they're going to be up and ready. If you come tomorrow, you, you'll surf through it. Let's keep going with Lucas Skywalker. That's no longer, no longer a 12 back. Desde la madrugada en España, un saludote a nuestros grandes amigos de Gintonic en el cine. Ojalá los podamos ver en, en abril. Luke Skywalker, X-Wing pilot. Not a 12 back, but it's still a lovely. Yes, sir. Believe it or not, Carlos. And then, hence why I'm going live. I wanted to show you. It's not just 12 back. Boxes and boxes and stuff. Let me sort through it. So, let's show this guy. By the way, this guy. It's graded by CIS, which is our favorite here in the house. He got A70 from CIS. Let's flip it a little bit. I kind of dig this guy. We should we should do this like more often, right? <laughs> They're looking at me like, no, 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 no. Thank you, Gin Tonic and Encina. So we have another 12 pack. This one is also graded by FAA. He got a 75. So we got. A really nice selection here, or very friend, good friend of Dead Squad Commander. I always liked that figure when I was growing up. I mean, the, the helmet was a little bit like, but you know, it was kind of cool. I remember, you know, recreating the whole mm. at the Dead Star, and that, that, that did it for me. Uh, this guy is not a 12 back, but it's a lovely. Get a free Boba Fett action figure um, offer, and actually, this is not the one with the sticker. Yeah, this is not the one with the sticker. This is a little bit after the rocket firing thing. It's our R5D4 with a Toys R Us sticker. Lovely, lovely. Um, well, you better come, Carlos. I've been inviting you to come since we opened, but you know, you you you're famous now. So this is graded by FAA, and he got a 75. Lovely figure. I love that car, man. It's a lovely R5 who, um, I guess I'll hand this over to you so you can have it there. We'll, we'll pack them up carefully later. So let me go and get the other back. What you guys is there up R5D4, who has a bad motivator. Bad joke, I know. I know, bad joke. So I guess we'll go straight up to no Empire. I don't see any Empire cards. Well, this guy this is an Empire Strikes Back figure, but on a Return of the Jedi card is a Imperial Commander. So let's drop him. Just try to go in, in the movie's order, right? If that's if it's supposed to be a. I don't think I have an Empire card. We'll check. We'll check. So let's just. Jump right in into the figures, and my favorite figure of all time within Star Wars, not graded. Bubble has seen a better day, but it's an unpunched Return of the Jedi Boba Fett card, which you can't you can't go wrong with Boba Fett. Big big hug to Michael Haven at the ICC, who has the biggest that I know of, the biggest um, Boba Fett collection that I ever seen my life okay this one is a beauty i don't want to tease everyone it's the you know power of the force pop-up r2 he's a pop-up look at the lovely green lightsaber coming out and he's rated by cis and he got a 70. you know people say well no 70 is a low grade or whatever i don't i don't think i personally don't think that 70s are low grades Everything 70 and above is, is decent in my case. Of course, you want to strive for the highest grades, but they're, they're just a handful. I know, I know 
other power of the force, an Imperial Gunner. Car is a, yeah, a Punch Boba Fett. You got that right, Gene Tony. Uh, this guy is also on Punch, by the way. And uh, it's cool. I really like this figure. That freaking gun facer, that freaking gun that loose is a pain in the neck. Let's flip it. Let's flip him over. Yep. It's a pain in the neck to, to find out the in the wild with all the reproduction. Let's keep getting power of the force. I love this thing. I, I said I want to do this for a living so I can tell everyone some of my clients to go to hell. I'm not there yet, but that's the goal. So I can just stock toys all day. Um, Luke Skywalker, Luke Puncho, if you will. Power of the Force card, also on punch, graded by CIS, and he got an 80. So this is a big hitter. That's a cool, that's, that's a really nice figure right there. I absolutely like that. Once again, I don't have the prices with me, but all of this will be priced in last 17. You got that right, sir. Um, well, I have actually have quite a few of them, besides the one that, that you've shown. Um, everything will be priced and ready starting tomorrow. So, Warrock, another power of the force. This little Ewok right there. I, spent, I don't know how, how long it's been trying to get that freaking bag. Not so long ago for a friend of mine. He is graded by CIS and he got a low name 75. It's an interesting card. You're missing EV9 in the collection. Oh man. Gin Tonic in a senior. Eso es un problemón conseguir a ese señor porque se le rompe el brazo. The arm is always an issue, but yo te trato de conseguir uno. Este, te doy mi palabra. Another power of the force, this one is on punch as well. Look, I'm talking like if I'm doing like a radio show or something. Um, an alien pilot, the green guy, graded by FAA, he got a 70. I want to know prices when you get it. Oh, come on, chaps, you gotta drive your ass down here, man. I'm not gonna talk prices on this because this is not a live auction or anything like that. Uh, yeah, man, That. look at that car. Beautiful, <laughs> beautiful car. Let's keep going, let's keep, let's keep checking. This guy is not graded. Be careful with that in the back, because I'm like, blah, blah, blah. be careful with that. So there's another power of the force car, Romba, on punch. This is a beautiful car, look at that. The bubble, I know, a little bit yellowish, but it's a beautiful car, totally on punch. Of course, the cases from our friend Ian Sanderson are included because you got to keep these things on this beautiful acrylic cases, which by the way, we're going to have those cases available for sale not so long ago. How you doing, Victor? Masters of Collectors. I don't know about that, but I'll try. I'll try my best. Thank you for watching, bro. All right. This is a very special Power of the Force car. It's a General Lando which that gun is also a pain in the neck lately. I, I really like this car. He got um, CIS 75 plus graded, but he has a Toys R Us sticker and it was signed by Billy D. William, the man himself, with the best attitude in the galaxy. What do we have here? Look at that. Signed by the man himself, P.D. Williams, who I had the pleasure to meet a few years ago. Lovely gentleman, still carrying swag. All right, we got Mr. Ford here on an old FAA. I wasn't a fan of this type of grade from FAA with the sticker above because it looks like a comic book. But it's a hand poncho and he got a 70. But, you know, it's a punch also. Beautiful card. Um, look what we have here. Be careful with Lando. Let's keep looking. Let's keep looking because I want to keep making this fast. Like I said, this is just, I've been trying to do this thing all day, but thankfully I, I, can, I can imagine doing this. You guys would have seen the amount of things that we have to make this like a two shot live 
So it was impossible with people. And I didn't want to do it from the cabin because I wanted her to show the cars like this. Another power of the force, this is a Luma. A car has seen better days, but still, you know, you know, the figure itself is pretty. But uh, here it is. For Luman fans, if you're, if you're looking for this little rascal to complete your collection, here it is. Another Ewok, like he probably Ewoks out. This one is a Tapu, and he got a 75 by CIS. I think it's a thin shape. I like it. I like it. Nice bubble. A decent 75 for this type of card. Cool, man. Cool. Let's keep digging in here to see what we have. Ian needs to send me more acrylic cases because I run out of them and have some on the star case. So, this Return of the Jedi Leia is kind of special because she is from Canada. Yep. This is a Canadian. 70 plus graded by CIS. Big hug to Robin Broca. Bocra. She always corrects me. Bocra. Because every time that I see this Leia, I, I, I think of her. Lovely card, carded Leia. All right. So this guy is graded also by CIS. He got a 70. It's a Tusken Raider on a Return of the Jedi card. Nothing, you know out of the ordinary but I wonder if I can show it here this guy is a hollow tubes so for you variant lovers this guy right here has a hollow tubes and that of course makes him an extra special he got a 70 from CIS the card is in clean in good shape and it has the Toys R Us sticker which brings memories into this crazy collection. That's why I, I wasn't exaggerating when we added the title and said massive collection. A B Wing pilot on a Power of the Force card, of course, um, ungraded, but in good shape. Put them here. I'm not spending too much time showing um, um, the cards itself because, you know, I want, I want to do this as fast as possible. Lumat. This one is on a, that, that's a nice bubble right there, man. Nice clean bubble. I like this bubble. Right. Ian, Ian, you need to send me those cases, brother. I want to start selling cases here, and then, you know, this guy deserves to be in acrylic. All right, who else have we got? I'm just speaking random stuff at this point. Another Ewok, a low gray. You know, sometimes people are missing this mischievous guy to fill in his collection. He's on punch. Or has seen better days, but you know, he has, Logray has his fans. He has a bad attitude in the movie, so, so I know people that love him. The Emperor. Everything has foreseen and as it has foreseen. Carlos Baron, you're gonna love this one. Emperor and the Power of the Force card. Also, and then a Gami on a Return of the Jedi card, but signed by the actor who portrayed that character and met that gentleman not so long ago. Pretty neat. Fortunito. There we go. All right, let's see. Okay, love it. This one is graded by CIS. He got a 75, but. The infamous Amana Man. Nice car. On punch. Well, yeah. Partially on punch, I will say. Has a little bit of denting there. But he got a 75 from CIS, so it's a, it's a decent chunk of cars. I'm going to hand over this thing to you while I get the other box. Last features are Return of the Jedi figures. We're still in that movie. Kind of common, but you know, it's part of the collection. This one is a Bib Fortuna on a Return of the Jedi car. A little yellowish on the bubble. But it's still the Wanawanga. Okay, we got a Klaatu. Also on an a, a punch. 
Return of the Jedi card. Not the hardest one to find, but decent one. Oh, we're going, we're going full Java's Palace here because we got a weak way and a return card. I think this is KB Toys. Yeah, KB Toys is sticker. I'm trying to surf through the whole thing as fast as I can. A prune face on a unpunched card that has a detail here. Details here, I can see. But it has an Anakin sticker offer. Maybe this is the variant that you're missing for your collection. Yeah. Alright, we stay. We go to the Forest Wood of Endor with an ATST driver and an unpunch card. I like this card. Looks pretty neat. Yeah, look at that. Pretty neat. Let's see, let's avoid the glare. Um, and he has seen better days as well, but I read these. Also carded, Return of the Jedi card. And then I left to the very end. we with you man so we got the band box max Rito band is box box has seen better days of course but I think if you're looking if I'm not mistaken Ian has uh, acrylic cases for this but if you're looking for this trio box here they are Let me put them back. then we have the Ryan core also box, box is actually that was it all Star Wars from the same person or or so Carlos you love you, you you should be a spy bro you love to know details and shit they just walked through the door that's all I need to know a speeder bike let's move the rancor out of the way this could be speeder bike the the tape broke here so I'm sure I gotta go through it, but buy a lot of you better. Yeah, man, this is one one of the biggest hauls ever. A twin pot cloud card from Best Bean, and this is completely sealed. It hasn't been opened. Box has some dents and stuff. There we go. And then the infamous, you can take that off, the infamous Chewbacca. Bandolier strap, if, if you all know, the foam inside, it was made of a material that disintegrates. I, I don't think they were expecting, uh, ya las articulaciones blancas, yeah, sir. Uh, no, but uh, Max Rebo is in great shape. Pásame la mano. It's the bubble. It's the bubble. It's in great shape. The figure is perfect. It's the bubble that's some, has some yellowish, but the figure is perfect. So, the Chewbacca bandolier, which seems to be the fair, and then to finish off, I love mini rigs, love mini rigs. A BME um, on a return at the Jedi car, the box, graded by CIS, and you got a 75. And with that, we'll close uh, this stream, live stream from the store, and I just wanted it for you guys to, to know what we just got through that door and which is going to be ready on the glass in the Minton car section available for anyone who decides to give us a visit and take a look. And uh, by the way, we're trying to display this type of thing in a museum type of way. So feel free to just come and take a look at it. You don't necessarily have to come and buy it. If you want to buy it, of course, we're here and we'll love to take care of you. Um, but Thank you everyone for watching. If you're watching on YouTube or Facebook, thank you for the support. It's been an amazing couple of weeks since we opened. People are showing up, showing support, buying stuff. I really cannot complain and I'm very, very, very thankful with everyone that has supported us in some way, in any, any type of way. Even sharing our posts helps a lot. So thank you so much. 
en la burbuja. De ese, sí, señor. Um, gracias. Thank you, Tony Gennesina, watching all the way from Madrid. Like, super late from Madrid. Carlos, who was in Orlando, and everyone else. En una buena por la tienda, es increíble. Thank you. Thank you, sir. So, thank you, everyone. And, uh, I mean, if you like this type of stuff, just leave us a comment, and we'll do every time that we get a haul like this. We'll do a live, and we'll show each one of them. Just leave us a comment, leave us your feedback. We read each and every one of them. Thank you. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.